Welcome back, everybody. I believe this is episode five, but I could be wrong. Uh, super good news, as you may have already even noticed. Server seems very responsive right at the moment, so this is excellent for video. I'm not having any leg issues. Um, actually, looked, and I might be the only person on the server right at the moment, as far as I can tell from when I logged on and the message from the server with the listing of clients, I was the only client. So, that's good. It's an excellent thing. So, this is what I've determined. Because wood's very easy to grow, and it sells for a decent price at the spawn shop, I am just going to plant just like a big, giant forest. And we're just going to go around, and again by we... I mean, I. I'm just going to go around and I am just going to chop a whole bunch of trees down. So, to start us off, let's throw a bunch of trees out. Saplings, saplings. Oh, you beautiful saplings. You mean money to me. Like, it's not even I'm planting these. If it wasn't for the money involved, I wouldn't be doing this. But I need that money. I gotta grind to get those messy crystals. So I can get that bell. Because I believe, and I could be entirely wrong, because of course, as I mentioned before, I've never used this messy crystal mod thing. So I really don't know too much about it. But the way I'm thinking this works is you grow the crystal on obsidian, and then you harvest, I'm assuming, either obsidian shards from it, or, or what am I saying obsidian shards? Messy shards, or you just get actual pieces of messy. I'm not 100% sure. Out in the distance, I see 007 is online. 007, welcome to you. If you ever happen to be watching this video, or if you ever become famous, know that it's because I mentioned you in this video. I think I have said that about every single person that I have called out on the server. And I don't know if called out is actually the right word, because usually when you call someone out, you're doing it because they're doing something stupid, or they're making a mistake, and you're calling them out. Which is totally not the case, because I have no idea what these people are doing, <laughs> other than, of course, playing. Like, I mean, no doubt that's what they're doing, but... Are they doing something illegal? Are they hacking? Are they just a bunch of hackers? You know, his name is 007. He could be a Linux hacker. And he's, uh... See, if I knew file system and permissions better for Linux, I would know what 007 means. You have read, write, and... I don't know what the other... Oh, no, wait, I'm thinking of that wrong. Um, I think, anyways. I'm just going to make a fool of myself here. <laughs> for anybody who actually knows. So on Linux, it's... It's 1, 2, and 4 are your... Um, what is it? User numbers, I think? It's either the users or the permission. It's got to be the permissions. And then by adding those three numbers together, you can get any other number. So for example, 5, wait, you can't get a 5. Because 7 is pretty much public. If something's at a 7, it means anybody can read or write. It's a public file. You know, I'm not even going to try to figure that out because I have no idea what I'm talking about. Other than 7's, it's like 7's 1's and 2's. But it can't be because it doesn't get high enough to reach 7. I don't know, but somehow it's just bit flags, and it determines who owns the file and who has permissions and who pretty much can do what with the file. But I'm sure that's of no interest to any of you watching this video, so I will stop boring you with that and bore you with chopping a bunch of trees instead. And I should really... Oh, some lag... I should really, really 
have these pieces of wood in an inventory slot where we can see them. Um, I guess I don't really need torches ever because it's never night. So those don't have to be in a main... Oh, I left them in a main inventory slot anyways. What is it? Was it the silver? It must have been the silver. Uh, silver can be used for armor, but one lump's not going to get me anything. And I got tin, but tin's pretty useless. Batteries and tin blocks. Because, you know, you need a lot of tin blocks all the time. You don't. You don't need tin blocks at all. Tin, in my opinion, is like the most worthless material that the Technic might add. I mean, literally, the only thing it's used for is batteries. And I think you can do tin armor. And then the tin blocks. But I think that's it. There's not a whole lot that uses tin. Oh, hey, that was an apple tree. Coolio, I could use the apples, I think. Because you don't have a hunger. Hold shift down when jumping, by the way. You're going down a long drop. It's it's a um it's a bug. It's not supposed to work that way. But if you hold shift down when you take a long jump, it'll negate some of the damage you get when you hit the bottom. Now it won't necessarily keep you from dying, but usually it keeps you from taking some of the damage. Okay, well we have 90 wood. 69 papyrus. I think it's time to visit spawn shop. Whoa, oh, I was gonna say what happened here? Alright, so two default tree gives you one thing of cash. Well, let's just sell us a bunch of wood. I don't know if I can just click super fast. I can. Okay. Well, we'll do that. 76 coin. Okay. And then the other thing. 10 papyrus will give you. Yeah, papyrus is not a good deal at all. It takes 10 papyrus to get one money and it takes two wood to get money well i i think i know what i'm doing okay, i need 20 money to get one messy crystal i can get four whoa hey 007 hello there wow how did he just how did he get a messy crystal dude i have four messy crystals and how many do I need to get this thing? Nine of them? Nine messy crystals to get one messy crystal seed. Well then, let's go back home and do some more grinding. I will put this in there for safekeeping. I'm going to throw those in there. Oh hey, I got wheat seeds. I should really plant those. Um, The apples I should keep on me. And yeah, let's plant this wheat seed up quick i know i was talking about in the last episode that i was going to put a fence up on that bridge Ooh, a little bit of lag there but you know what i don't think it's worth it not right now i can get way more money selling logs and money is more important to me than the safety of little kids and old people not that there's any little kids or old people that are coming out to my house anyway so it really makes no difference as far as little kids and old people go <laughs> but at the current time it is of far more value to me to just sell this wood rather than turning it into sticks to build fences because the the primary thing I shouldn't say the primary thing. One of the primary things. One of the main things. I don't even know if it was a primary thing. But one of the things that uh, I was supposed to make sure I covered in this short series here was the messy crystals and the crystalline bells. So, of course, I want to live up to my word. Though, as I've mentioned before, in the last episode, and I don't know if I mentioned it ever prior to that, I'm just doing this for free. 
not being paid by the server host or owner or admins or anything. Just doing it out of the goodness of my heart. Actually, uh, it's, uh, it's a little deeper Reddit than that. Um, see, so these videos are on YouTube, obviously, because that's where you're watching this right now, actually. If you, if you didn't notice, yes, you are on YouTube. Well, at least the video is hosted on YouTube. I guess you could be on a different website. You could even be on my website, for all I know, right at the moment. If you are, cool beans, man. Thanks for visiting. If you're not, whatever. It's the lame website you're on. JK. But, back on topic here. Um, the reason, actually, that I do these videos... And this is going to sound super horrible. Super horrible. But I'm in it for the money, man. I'm in it for the money. And I can make a couple pennies on a YouTube video. It's totally a very lucrative business at this point in time. Like, uh, I'm making like two bucks a month. So I'm making just hand over fist of money right now doing YouTube. And, you know, there's really nothing, nothing involved in it. You know, I'm... Obviously, I have to record it. Ooh, minor 48-er. Minor 48-er. I thought they were minor 49-er. Anyway, back onto the subject of YouTube. Um, at this point in time, I'm making about two bucks a month, which isn't shabby. Uh, but it, it's kind of picking up. And what's the big thing you need on YouTube? Content. You gotta have content. If you don't have videos, that would be the content, mind you. There's nothing for people to watch. And I don't know why there's a super dark spot here. Other than lighting bug. Lighting bug that doesn't want to go away. Wow, okay. I'll plant a sapling. When that sapling grows, it should fix it. Um, but yeah, so in order to make money on YouTube, you have to have content on YouTube that people are watching. And, well, my test is what I do, so it was only a logical decision to me. I don't even know where these are falling from. It was only a logical decision to me to make more YouTube videos about my test. And if somebody owns a server and wants me to make a video for them, well, why not? It's what I do. So, yeah, one day in the future, when I'm rich and famous... Uh, yeah, thanks for playing the little part that you did and watching this video, and if you had to sit through an ad before the video, which you would have unless you're using an ad blocker, uh, yeah, just know that that ad put uh, a penny or two in, in my pocket. Helped me put food on the table. Helped me, uh, um, I don't know what. Helped me buy a new microphone. Oh, no, wait, I got a nice microphone. No, actually jokes aside here people uh is it the yeti i think it's called i think just yeti or yeti blue that's a nice microphone i've never used one myself so i i i guess i can't really say from personal experience if it's a nice microphone but i listened to uh an audio podcast by a couple guys that actually do a YouTube channel as well, and uh, they were, I guess the guys from Yeti sent them a, I think it was Yeti Blue, I think is what they had, just to uh, demo for an episode, kind of just to see what they thought of it, you know, when you get famous, companies just send you stuff, now they did have to return it, so it wasn't like they got it to keep for keeps, but they used it in the episode, and... Not gonna lie, I really didn't notice a big difference between that and the the normal microphones they use, which I don't know what they were using. But uh I know with the Yeti at least, it's USB. It's got a preamp already built in, so you pretty much just plug it in with USB and you're good to go. You don't need an external sound card or even an internal sound card for that matter, just it's all right off the USB, which is super cool. What I have right now is a um, a Samson M10. I actually had to look at it to see what it was. I don't know why I did home. I want to do spawn. I have a Samson M10 
and that runs through a mobile pre USB audio uh, preamp or something along those lines uh, and it's yeah it works fine um, the only one thing I kind of dislike on it and that's more the fault of just my setup and not the fault of the mic itself is it's really not close enough to my mouth so the audio is not always loud enough but it picks up good enough quality that I'm usually able to amplify it just fine and then run noise reduction and pull out the static and the hiss and it sounds fine I mean like I mean obviously you're listening to it right now and I'm assuming your ears aren't bleeding so they can't be that bad <laughs> 20 money. Okay, so that's going to give me three more. I forget how many I had at home. I don't think I have quite enough. But I'm almost there. I have eight. I need nine. Well, nine to get the crystal, and then I need more to get the bell. What are we sitting at? We're sitting at 16 and a half minutes. You know, I'm going to grab these. We're going to chop some more wood real quick. And we'll try to get this last messy crystal. So I can get the crystal plant thing. Whatever it is. Because I feel like I have obsidian someplace. Oh, wait. Wait, I thought I had obsidian. I didn't put that in this chest, did I? Oh, but it is a lock chest. So, so Yeah, I did. Okay. It's a lock chest, so nobody can steal it, so that's okay. Okay, five is going to give me two. Let's give me three. All I have to do is get... I need to get... What? What? That was weird. Okay, I don't know what happened there. Um, Two trees get me one dollar. And the crystal was $20. So I need 40 trunks, approximately. But I got some money sitting around right now. So get about 40 trunks. And I'll be good. And shift fall. And we're okay. Yay! I shouldn't really be cheering, because that's a bug and it should be fixed. Because it gives the exploiters of the bug an unfair advantage. Now that's, I mean, mainly that's just going to be in a PvP type situation. But if I'm attacking you, or I guess more so you're attacking me, and I know about the shift bug and you don't, I guess I should call it the sneak bug. Because it, you're hitting the sneak key, you may not have your same figure to shift. Um, you hit that when you're falling. So I can jump off a tall cliff and hit that button so when I hit the ground I don't get hurt and if you don't know about that you're gonna follow me in the jump and you're probably gonna die whereas I won't and it's super unfair but I guess that's what happens when when uh, there's bugs you know unfair things can happen and this is starting to get a little too laggy for my liking. Why is it doing this? There's only one other player that hopped on. Minor 48er. Oh wait, no, I take that back. There's... I don't know if that's one? One, one, two, two, one, one? I don't think so. Well, whoever you are, he hopped on. She hopped on. I... You tell me, is line line two two line line a boy name or a girl name? For that matter, is 007 a boy name or a girl name? <laughs> and what about minor 48? -er? Is that a boy name or a girl name? I don't know. So before you throw me on a witch trial, um, yeah, I, yeah, I guess maybe I'm just stupid, and I don't know if that's a boy or a girl name. 
But uh, yeah, I guess if you do, you can let us all know in the comments and enlighten us with your wisdom. Wisdom that obviously I do not have. Oh, hey, we got enough wood. Perfect. Okay. Let's go sell this stuff. Uh huh. Uh huh. I have a couple bucks left over. Sweet. Cool beans. Cool beans. Okay. Get a crystal. Mm hmm. All right. And get get one of these guys. Nine crystals give me one crystal seed, which looks nothing like that, which is what I was anticipating. And I need two messy crystals to get this crystalline bell thing. Okay, well that will be that'll be for next time. But right now, I'm gonna turn this little back room right here into wait. Oh, I was gonna say I thought that's how you did it. Okay, so it I I really don't know what I do now. It doesn't give me any kind of an info text. It's just kind of... It's there. It wouldn't make sense that I could... Harvest it right away. But the one that spawns never grown. It's always been looking like this. I don't know. I guess we'll find out together in the next episode. I'm just going to go plant some trees really quick to... Uh, you know, make sure that I have a sustainable ecosystem here. I would hate to be branded as a tree killer. And, you know, we'll just make sure that the countryside has a lot of trees. Far more than it started with. And turn this into a whole forest. And then, somebody's going to complain that there's too many trees. You just You just can't win in this world anymore. You know, you go cut down the trees and you get Greenpeace out there threatening to, like, kill you and stuff because you're cutting down a tree. So then you replant the trees, and then you get... I don't know who, PETA. And then PETA's out there, and they're complaining that you're planting too many trees and that you're going to unbalance the natural habitat of, you know, like some weird bug or something that nobody's ever heard of but the PETA people. And quite honestly, nobody cares about because it's just some weird random bug that, that you know, it does nothing to the ecosystem. You know, it's, it's a bug. Big deal. But yeah, you just, you can't win anymore. It's horrible. So yeah, leave your hate comments below, I guess. Just leave all the comments below. I mean, that's honestly the only place you really can leave them. So if you do have comments, that's where you leave them. All right, well. That was about 53 trees I just planted. And my door doesn't want to close. So we're going to call it a day. And we will pick up the same place next time. Which will be tomorrow. So I'll see you then. Thanks for watching my video. Really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, would you consider giving it a thumbs up? I appreciate all those I can get. I'm on social media, peoples. Follow me. Google+, Plus, Twitter. Facebook. I always post all of my videos on those platforms, or links to my videos on those platforms, as soon as they go live. Which this means prior to the release on YouTube. You can watch them before anybody else. You can also visit my website, NathanSalpat.com, and see all my videos there. Really nice website, if I do say so myself. I did design it, so I might be a little bit biased, but I still think it's, it's decent. If there is a mod you would like me to review, just click on the request a view button right there. Takes a two form on my website. You just type in the information, hit the submit button. I get it. I look at it. Record a review. Post it online. You watch. We all profit. The world's a better place. Yeah, I don't know about that last bit. But hey, do it anyways. There's you got nothing to lose. I'll catch you next time.